for some people, this meta AI on their WhatsApp is either annoying or frustrating, or they just don't want it. They don't want it on their WhatsApp. They want to go back to using their WhatsApp, how it was before this meta AI came as a new feature. And I'm sure you watching this video, you also want to go back to using your WhatsApp as it was before this meta AI. So for that reason, I'm creating this video. For my video today, I'm going to be telling you the step-by-step -step process on how you can remove this you know, meta AI on your WhatsApp, how to delete this meta AI from your WhatsApp entirely, yes. So all you need to do is to watch this video to the very end to get the full information, right? Make sure you feel the step-by-step -step process in this video to the very end so that I can get this meta AI either removed or get this meta AI deleted from your device, okay? So guys, as you can see on my WhatsApp, you know, this feature is not there. I don't have the meta AI. It is not on my WhatsApp at all. So how did I do it? How was I able to remove it from my WhatsApp? So the very first thing you want to do is to delete your WhatsApp. But wait, before you delete it, wait, do not delete it yet. Make sure you back up your WhatsApp. Guys, make sure you back up your WhatsApp before deleting it so that you will not lose your chat. Have you backed up your WhatsApp? If you've done that, then let's go. So now what you now need to do is to go to your browser. Okay, whatever browser you're using, just go there. And then once you click on old version WhatsApp, right? Old version okay, WhatsApp. So can you see, once you get to this place, you click on this first website, old versions of WhatsApp Messenger. This is okay. So now that you are here, what you need to do is to scroll down. Guys, can you see what this website does is to, you know, upload every single day in version of WhatsApp. Can you see it says here, May 29, May 25, May 22, May 21, May 21, May 17, May 14, May 11, May 9, May 8. Can you see it? It goes on and on and on. So you ask yourself, okay, you check. Do not ask yourself because I'm sure you may not know. You can check when did this version of WhatsApp, the Meta AI, come on board. So let's say, for example, it came on May 1st. What you need to do is now download maybe April 19, 24. Click on it. Okay, can you see it is a 891.6 million downloads with several thousand reviews. Wow. Okay. So click on download. Okay. And now it is downloading over here. Right. So once it is done downloading, guys, you are going to just wait. Just wait, okay. It says download anyway. Let me check it. So this is downloading now and it's actually going to take a while. So let me just explain what you're going to do once it is downloaded, right? Because it's going to take a very long time to do that. Once you've downloaded it, all you need to do is to install it, yes, on your device. So once you've installed this on your device, then you're now logging with your number and now bring back that your back chat. Remember I told you guys to back up your chat. You're now bringing your chat, right? So once you bring in your chat, and everything is done, you now get your standard version of WhatsApp, the older version of WhatsApp, and you are good to go. So what this means is, you will not update this app. Since you don't like this meta AI version, you don't have to update it, right? So that you don't get that meta AI because it's now a new feature. Whenever you update the app, it's going to come along with it. So just keep on using the older version of WhatsApp and you are good to go. And guys, I'm not sure if it's also going to work for the iPhone users, right? I don't know if it's going to work for the iPhone users because we all know that you cannot download in your apps from let's say websites or third party places. Okay, so I don't know how it's going to work for you guys. So if you're using an iPhone, then I guess you are just maybe stuck with this version of WhatsApp, right? So maybe next time, before you update your WhatsApp, if we just like, Ask other people how the you know, update is before you update it on your iPhone. So if this works for you, let me know in the show and do not forget to share this video to other research on this information. Okay, I'm going to see you guys in my next video as we discover more ways we can solve our social media problems. See you guys.